What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another installment of Mr. Eric Reads. Tonight we've got a classic book retold by Arlene Mosel and it's known as Tiki Tiki Timbo. Now you may have heard this fiction tale before. Uh, if you have, enjoy it again. If you have not yet, sit back, relax, and enjoy a tale that has a very fun, silly tongue twister of a name um, in Tiki Tiki Timbo. On Mr. Eric Reads. Once upon a time, a long, long time ago, it was the custom of all the fathers and mothers in China to give their first and honored sons great, long names. But second sons, they were given hardly any name at all. So in a small mountain village, there lived a mother who had two little sons. Her second son, she called Chang, which meant little or nothing. But her first and honored son, she called Tiki Tiki Timbo Nosa Rimbo Chari Bari Ruchi Pip Harry Pimbo, which meant the most wonderful thing in the whole wide world. Every morning, the mother went to wash in the little stream near her home. The two boys always went chattering along with her, and on the bank was an old well. Don't go near the well warned the mother, or you'll surely fall in. The boys did not always mind their mother, of course, and one day they were playing beside the well when Chang fell in. Tiki Tiki Timbo, Nosa Rimbo, Chari Bari Ruchi, Pip Perry Pimbo ran as fast as his little legs could carry him to his mother, where he said, Most honorable mother, Chang has fallen into the well. The waters roar, little blossom. I cannot hear you, said the mother. Then, Tiki Tiki Timbo, Nosa Rimbo, Chari Bari Ruchi, Pip Perry Pimbo raised his voice and cried, Oh, most honorable one, Chang has fallen into the well. That troublesome boy, answered the mother. Run and get the old man with the ladder to fish him out. Then Tiki Tiki Timbo, No Rimbo, Chari Bari Ruchi, Pip Perry Pimbo, ran as fast as his little legs could carry him to the old man with the ladder and said, Old man with the ladder, Chang has fallen into the well. Will you come and fish him out? So, said the old man with the ladder, Chang has fallen into the well. And as he ran as fast as his old legs could carry him, step over step, step over step, he went to the well, picked up little Chang, and step over step, step over step, brought him out of the well. He pumped the water out of him and pushed the air into him and pumped the water out of him and pushed the air into him. And soon, Cheng was just as good as ever. Now, for several months, the boys did not go near that well. But after the festival of the eighth moon, they ran to the well to eat their cakes. They ate near the well, they played around the well, they walked on the well, and Tiki Tiki Timbo, Nosa Rimbo, Chari Bari Bucci, Ruchi, Pip Perry Pimbo fell into the well.
Chang ran as fast as his little legs could carry him to his mother and said, Oh, most honorable mother, Tiki Tiki Timbo, No Sao Rimbo, Charibari Ruchi, Pit Peri Pimbo has fallen into the well. The waters roar, little one. I cannot hear you. So little Chang took a deep breath. Oh, mother, most honorable. He panted. Tiki Tiki Timbo, No Sao Rimbo, Charibari Ruchi, Pit Peri Pimbo has fallen into the well. Tiresome child, what are you trying to say? said his mother. Honorable mother, Chari, Bari, Rimbo, Tiki, Tiki, he gasped. Pip, Pip has fallen into the well. Unfortunate son. You speak your brother's name with reverence. Poor little Chang was all out of breath from saying that great long name, and he didn't think he could say it one more time. But then he thought of his brother in the old well. Chang bowed his little head clear to the sand, took a deep breath, and slowly, very slowly said, Most honorable mother, Tiki Tiki Timbo No Sa Rimbo Chari Bari Ruchi Pip Peri Pimbo is at the bottom of the well. Oh, not my first and honored son, heir of all I possess. Run quickly and tell the old man with the ladder that your brother has fallen into the well. So Chang ran as fast as his little legs could carry him to the old man with the ladder. Under a tree, the old man with the ladder sat bowed and silent. Oh man, oh man, shouted Chang. Come right away. Tiki Tiki Timbo, No Sa Rimbo, Chari Bari Ruchi, Pit Peri Pimbo has fallen into the stone well. but there was no answer. Puzzled, he waited. Then, with his very last breath, he shouted, Old man! Tiki Tiki Timbo, No Sao Rimbo, Charibari Ruchi, Pit Peri Pimbo is at the bottom of the well. Miserable child, you disturbed my dream. I had floated into a purple mist and found my youth again. There were glittering gateways and jeweled blossoms. If I close my eyes, perhaps I will return again. Poor little Cheng was frightened. How could he say that great long name again? Please, old man with the ladder, please help my brother out of the cold well. So, said the old man with the ladder, your mother's precious pearl has fallen into the well? The old man with the ladder hurried as fast as his old legs could carry him. Step over step, step over step, he went into the well. And step over step, step over step, out of the well with the little boys in his arm. Then he pumped air into him. Pumped the water out. Pumped the water out of him and pushed the air into him. But little Tiki Tiki Timbo no Sa Rimbo Chari Bari Ruchi Pit Peri Pimbo had been in the water so long, all because of that great long name, that the moon rose many times before he was quite the same again. And from that day on, it has been known and thought to be wise to give all the children little short names instead of great long names. The end. 
Again, this was Tiki Tiki Timbo, retold by Arlene Mosel. A fun, fictional old story um, that, you know, just a fun little listen. Hope you guys enjoyed that story, as always. Again, this was borrowed uh, from my, the Herman family out in Appling. Thank you guys so much again for the stories that I get to share with everybody here on Mr. Eric Reads. So, hope you enjoyed that story, guys. Go out, be kind, wash your hands, practice safe social distancing, yeah? And hopefully sooner rather than later, we will be all together again. One can only hope. So, like I said, guys, take care of yourselves and be kind, and I will see you guys around.